laying there when I went in the dust, and I remember I started coughing. And the strangest thought came to my mind is that dead men don't cough, because I must still be alive. Dave Lim's story is the rarest of all. He was inside the Trade Center when it collapsed and lived to tell the tale. He started that day as he always did, an officer in the Port Authority's canine unit. When the first plane hit, he ran to help, directing people to stairwells. That's where he encountered the woman sitting next to him in this photo. Her name is Josephine Harris. At the time, she was exhausted and unable to walk anymore. Amid the chaos, Dave chose to stay by Josephine's side. The decision put his life in great danger, but as fate would have it, it saved his life as the North Tower came down on top of them. It was more like a like an avalanche or an on, a sound of an onrushing locomotive. You can feel the air as the, the floors are pressing down on each other, compressing on top like a hurricane. When the horror stopped, David and Josephine were still alive. 110 stories of World Trade Center were on top of them. They were in a pocket on the fifth floor of Stairwell B. It was a very strange feeling because for a few seconds I was like, oh, thank God I'm alive. And then it was, how the heck do I get out of here? They had a lot of work to do in the dark. David tried to head down, but he was blocked by debris. The only option, head up, as desperate as it sounded. And that's where we saw what was a light, and I thought it was the light on the sixth floor. It turned out to be the sun. Only 16 people made it out alive, all in stairwell B of the North Tower. Officer Lim and Josephine among them. People have said to me that uh, I've been blessed and that I have uh, another purpose or so forth. And I, I, I have a hard time accepting that fact. It's not that I don't believe in God or that God did not save me. It's just that I don't feel I'm as deserving or any more deserving than those 3,000 people that were killed. Reflecting after two decades, Dave's insight is as simple as it is profound. I've learned to appreciate the little things in life, you know, like my daughter's concert or just sitting on a bench and enjoying nature. You know, things like things that I never had time for, if you would. A great lesson for all of us from a 9-11 hero who is actually still with us. John Muller, PIX11 News.